Hello, Chris Wurden. Uh, so today's video is basically going to answer the question, liquidation or strike your company off, what things should you be considering before you make a decision? So listen, all the videos we do here, they're aimed at making insolvency a little bit easier for you to understand. It's an absolute minefield, this industry. And, and if you're, you're looking at going and closing your company down, you need to be informed properly. So back to the original question. We don't advise this, but, but there's lots of UK company directors out there that, that decide to try and strike their company off from the company's house register um, rather than going into voluntary liquidation. So if your business is struggling financially and you've got two options, one of them I can do is going to cost me a tenner or one of them is going to cost me £5,000, you would be forgiven thinking that the £10 option is going to be the best option for you. But I want you to consider these two things. Now, number one, if you dissolve a company, a limited company, you are unable to make a claim for redundancy. So you'll have seen videos about this in the past. If you are on the pay-as-you-earn scheme and you've been on the pay-as-you-earn scheme for over two years, so, so technically you're an employee of the company and you have to liquidate, you can make a claim for direct redundancy. Now, the average claim is £9,000. So think about it. The claim is £9,000. It's going to cost you £5,000 to liquidate the company. You're four grand up. And if you dissolve the company, you pay that £10, you are unable to make a claim for redundancy. Now, the second thing is, is if you dissolve a company, it can still be reinstated. So sometimes people will try and strike off a company, dissolve a company that has debts. The creditors don't eject. The company gets dissolved. But for 15 years after that, your creditors can reinstate that company and come to you potentially personally for the company debts. So with a voluntary liquidation, the company is, is, is closed down legally, formally, and it's gone, it's disappeared. Yes, it's going to cost you some money, but potentially you might have a claim. And your claim, in most circumstances, is going to co cover the cost of any liquidation and, um, you know, and put some money in your pocket. Now, I've got to add on to this. Listen, if you've taken a bounce back loan, it's highly unlikely that the bank is going to allow you to strike that company off if you plan to dissolve it. So, listen, I understand how difficult it is when your business is in debt. I know because I was there a few years ago before I set up First Business Rescue. If you want to speak to somebody informally, in confidence, with no strings, no obligation, get in touch with us. If you've got any questions, drop them in the comments below. If you've liked and found this useful, like and share the video. Listen, there are people out there that can help you through these really challenging times, and we are one of those. Thank you for your time, and I look forward to speaking with you. Goodbye.